Hey everybody, what's going on? Speedy Diver here, and I am really, really excited for this month's airdrop crates. For the month of September 2019, this crate in front of me right here is an e-crate. That's the theme. It's e-crate. I don't know what that means, but I'm excited because last month's airdrop crates was the best airdrop crates I have ever ever opened and i'm not just saying that to say that i'm saying that because seriously last month's crate was my favorite crate they ever did so that is leading high expectations for this month's crate so i'm hoping there's some great stuff in here now with that being said if you are interested in picking up an airdrop crates for yourself by the time the video ends or if you just want to pick one up right now you can use code speedy and save five percent off your entire order which is freaking awesome so let's get into this month's airdrop crates. Oh, I'm so excited. As you can see, it says share your unboxing photo or video for a chance to win a one month subscription. Also, there's social medias down here as well. On this side, hashtag get dropped in the comment section below. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm, I haven't been this excited for an airdrop crate in so long, just because last month's was so good. So let's get into it. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da 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 -da. I'm still waiting for the time, like the day they actually put something here. I don't know why, but I love when you open a box and you go like this and you can read something here. Like if it says something here, that would look so good and it would be really, really cool for video as well as just anybody unboxing it. So uh, let's get into it. Oh, this is so exciting. First thing you always get is a letter, which I absolutely love. It says, thank you. It says, Dear Valued Customer, thank you for purchasing with Airdrop Crates and welcome to the family. We value you and are forever grateful for your support. Please note that a product within the crate has ran out of stock. That's new. Ooh, spicy. And have compensated it with another product that is equivalent or greater in price. Don't forget to tag us and upload pictures of the crate on Twitter. That's a little interesting. So what ran out of stock? I wonder what that product is. That is actually really intriguing. First thing, what? What? Is that what I think it's? It's a Red Bull. What? <laughs> How insane is this? You get an energy drink. That is cool. I've never seen that before. An actual Red Bull. That is cool. I wonder if this is the item they compensated you with maybe? I'm not too sure. That is so freaking good. It's a literally like a little bitty Red Bull. These things are expensive too. These are like four bucks. That is freaking awesome. Personally, I do not drink Red Bull, but uh, I do know a couple people who may drink this, so that is freaking awesome. That is actually super interesting. Okay, we got a Red Bull. That is awesome. That is so cool. Second item in the box is looking like a mouse pad or a keyboard pad. Nope, it's just a giant mouse pad, and it has the Airdrop Crate logo in the middle. That is actually kind of cool. I do like it. Very good quality as well. It's like a regular mouse pad would be nowadays. Uh, I like that. It's got all different games, as you can see, all the way around. One thing that's kind of weird, though, is the uh, the middle here. I don't know why it's, like, uh, pink. It, that's not the color of their, like, their logo. Like, it's supposed to be white. Why it's pink, I don't know. It's a little strange. So I'm definitely liking that. You got all different games in there and such. Okay, nice. I'm going to keep that down there for now. That's actually pretty cool. Next, let's see what else we have. What is this? I don't know what this is. Uh, obviously, it has the Airdrop Crate logo on it. So it's 3D printed. This is 3D printed material, 100%. Is this for, I think they hinted away, this is actually a, uh, oh, I know what this is. Okay, this right here is actually for a mouse. If you have a wired mouse, and that's why they give you a mouse pad. If you have a wired mouse, you actually run the cable over into this slot right here, and then you have the mouse right here and whatnot, and that way it gives you way more movement. You don't have like the restriction of the mouse cord pulling. So you can actually move anywhere with the mouse and it's very fluent and it's more, uh, it, it's easier to game with it, put it that way. And you could be a better gamer that way. Uh, I personally use a wireless mouse because I'm not like a heavy duty gamer. Because uh, wired is always better for anything you use. But uh, I use a wireless mouse because I'm just like lazy and whatnot. But yeah, so uh, <laughs> this is uh, pretty cool actually. It's got nice little feet on the bottom here. That's actually really cool, really random, but very cool as well, because you could actually use that and really enjoy it. That is kind of a cool product. I kind of like that. Next, in the crates. Am I seeing something that I'm absolutely falling in love with right now? I see two things. Guys. What? A karambit knife. 
That is a knife. That is... <gasps> I have fallen in love right now. That is epic. Oh, and it has like a white paint splatter kind of look to it. <gasps> Ooh, it has a sheath and everything. That is cool. The string, the paracord string with the sheath. <sighs> oh, this is so cool. This is... This is like CSGO kind of cool. Like, that's what everyone always, like, kind of references Karambits from is CSGO. I think they're just, like, super cool knives. I personally have my own. I will show you guys because I am that excited. This is my personal one. It's a little knife like this, which is super duper cool. It has the teeth and all that. But, uh... This one is a standalone fixed blade, so it's always out. This one's actually spring-loaded, so you just flip that and it goes out. This one is my die-hard knife. Like, this is my go-to. But, uh, just for, like, unboxings, anything. And now this... Oh, I can't wait to look at the blade. Oh, that is sick. That is so pointy. Oh, look at that! That is crazy. It has the white paint splatter look as the other end. I... Guys... I think the only other kind of cool blade you could get would just be like a neon green or a gold. That's the only colors I would go for. The black with the white paint splatter, I love. Absolutely love this. That is so cool. It is relatively sharp too, which is actually kind of cool. I like that. Usually when people give out knives and stuff, like uh, companies sell knives, they're usually not too sharp because uh, they just don't do that. I don't know, but this is actually like always test out a knife. You go sideways with it to see the sharpness of it. It's relatively sharp, and it has a really cool case. It's a plastic case, plastic sheath, and it clips in so that when you go like this, it doesn't unclip, but you have to really pull it. That is so cool. That is freaking awesome. I love it. That right there makes this box so worth getting. I am in love with this month so far. Let's see what else. Ooh, what is this? Ooh, it's squishy. What is this? What are you? I know what this is. Oh, this is cool too. Oh, this box is so good this month. So have any of you guys ever had cable management problems before? Ba-boom! This right here is to solve all of those issues. This is a cable management sleeve. So basically, you wrap this thing around the cables that you want to hide, you close it shut, and you have a black sleeve over a bunch of cables to make it just cleaner. A cleaner setup, a cleaner gaming setup, cleaner anything. It could be an editing set, like setup, just anywhere, office, things like that. This is really nice, and this will be used 100%. I actually have a couple of these, not with the zipper, but actually like Velcro. These hide cables very, very well. And this is so cool to see in a gaming subscription box. This is something every gamer, and I'm not just saying that. Literally every gamer needs something like this. Every gamer. Because you want your cables to be hidden. You want your setup to be clean and really good looking. This is awesome. Let's see what else is in here. And I see something that I'm loving. And you get food. You get food. You get food. You get a drink. You get everything you need. It's a freaking beef and cheese stick. Beef and cheese beef stick. I love it. I absolutely love it. I love when Airdrop Crate gives snacks in their boxes. They are so awesome. Who doesn't love this snack when they game? I don't know a single person who doesn't like snacking while they game. Especially now we get an energy drink in this month's crate and a freaking edible item. Like, you can actually eat this. It's a beef stick. That is so awesome. Oh, I love it. So there's still more in the crate. Now, next I'm seeing the poster, which is E-Crate. Still don't know what E-Crate stands for, to be honest. Electronic crate, maybe? Maybe that's what it's for, I don't know. But uh, as you can see, it says get dropped in the corner. This is the little poster that they give you. And on the other side, shows you what you get in the crate and also shows you next month's theme. Next month's theme is Villain Crate for October. That is looking kind of creepy. That is looking very, very creepy. I would love to see a lot of horror related items in that crate only because like, I want to see a lot of horror games because it's October. I'm hoping they do that. So as you can see, you get the Red Bull can, you get the cheese stick. You also get the cable management sleeve. It actually shows you how to use it, which is kind of cool. The Karambit knife, the mouse pad, and also the mouse bungee. That's what they call it, a mouse bungee. And uh, I guess maybe in this crate we didn't get compensated for something. I don't know. I don't know what that item was that they were talking about. But I love the poster. Next we have the sticker, which is the E-Crate September's theme airdrop crate sticker. They always give a sticker every single month as well as a poster for that theme. 
And that is looking like that is it in the box. So now is the part of the video where I let you guys know what I think each item in the crate is actually worth. Starting off with the sticker. This is, I always give the stickers a dollar value. So this is a dollar sticker. The posters, I always give $2. So that's a $2 poster right there as well. The Red Bull, these actually sell for about $4, I believe, in the stores. So that's a $4 value. Next is the Mouse Bungee. This I would be giving probably about a like a $7 value. The beef stick, this I would give a, beef sticks are expensive, they really are, like beef jerky and all that, this is probably like a three, $4 stick. This could really be about a $6 sleeve. I know that it's kind of expensive, but uh, these are actually uh, relatively a lot of money, believe it or not. So I'd give this about a $6 value. There's also the mouse pad, which is really cool. It is nice material. As you can see on the edges, it has a nice pipe lining and whatnot. This I'd probably give a $8 value. Pretty nice mouse pad. I probably will be using this, so I do like that. And last but not least, the best item, in my opinion, in the crate is the Karambit knife. That is so epic. Such a cool item to get in the gaming subscription box. I love the black with the white paint splatter look. It looks so, so good. Fits nice in the hand, a little tiny for my hands, but it is a really nice letter opener. Literally, you can use this as a unboxing opener. It is really, really, really nice. I'd be giving this a $15 value. So with all that being said, I hope you guys really enjoyed this month's unboxing. This was my favorite box by far. Last month's box was really, really good, but this month's box kind of blew it away because of the Karambit knife. This is mind-blowingly cool. I absolutely love this. So uh, with that being said, guys, hope everyone really enjoyed. I will be leaving all the Airdrop on Crate unboxings right over here. There's a lot of them. Go check them out if you like this one. Also, make sure you guys check out my merchandise over here. Subscribe to The Speedy Gamer if you guys like gaming videos. And subscribe to The Speedy Diver if you enjoyed this unboxing and you want to see more to come. So if you did want to pick up an Airdrop Crate, make sure you do use code SPEEDY and check out the link in the description below for the Airdrop Crate's website to go check out their crates. Come back tomorrow for another epic video and I'll catch you guys on the flip side.